a question was asked um, a question was directed to a rabbi Jew that can a Jew study the Quran and get to know more about Islam is it allowed in Judaism so let's hear what this rabbi has to say I saw today on Facebook article and it says that in Britain they decide to have uh, from next year in all private schools studying to religious so in Muslim they decide to choose Jewish and uh, one of the biggest rabbi in uh, over there he decided to take a Muslim religious as a second study so do you think is this right what they sp they're supposed to take a religious study in the, in the schools in Britain yes in it's England. a new law in Britain yes so you have to take a religious so the ma is a second is, is, is a, not besides your own religion besides your own religion so the yes. Muslim took Judaism so should the Jews take to, uh, the Muslim religion well, we have to realize that the Muslim, why did the Muslim take Jewish religion? Because we live in the same, we believe in the same principles. We believe in one God. They don't believe in Christians, believe in the, in the Trinity, and there's a, and the man is part of God, and so on. So that is uh, a, a, a totally against uh, the Muslim religion, because they believe in one God, because they believe in the Torah and one God. So that's why they took, chose Judaism, because that's basically, even their food that they eat, you see that the uh, different uh, restaurants of the Muslims, what they call it? Uh, halal, halal meat, which halal means halal. You make a bracha on it, take, take it from the Jewish, because when the Jewish people slaughter an animal, make a bracha, say halal, they make a bracha also on it. And they have a law by them, in case you're stuck and don't have any halal meat, you can eat kosher meat from the Jews, because we have the same type of thing that they have. So a lot of things that... Uh, that the Jewish religion and the Muslim religion are the same, because mainly because they believe in one God. Mm. They call Allah, Allah. This comes from Elokah. This from the Jewish. It's all taken from the Judaism. Mm. The Allah is Elokah, and uh, you're allowed to mention because I'm much mentioned. So uh, all these things are very close to um, Judaism. Jewish. Now, if you ask me, if the, that's why the, the Muslims chose to, chose to study Judaism. Should Jews study? Um, the Muslim religion, I really can't comment on that because I don't know what the religion, what they teach, I don't know what it's all about, so I can't say a uh, uh, real, real opinion on it. Mm. But it's certainly closer to the Jewish religion than any other religion because it's um, based on the one God and based on the most of the commandments of the Torah. So it could be that that would be the best thing for to, to study, but I can't really say because I'm not fluent in the, in the Quran. They said the Quran, what's in the Quran? I don't know exactly what's there. Did you study the Koran, Rabbi? Uh, no, I've never studied Koran. Yeah. So I, don't, I know more about the other religion that's further from us, but I don't know. Uh, so I don't know. That's really a, 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 Not yet. Really a very funny kind of funny, I mean, very strange kind of uh, relationship we have. Here the Muslims are so anti-Jewish, most of them, and the Christians are, are more acceptable by Jews than the Muslims are. And, and the other... But the truth of that matter is, our religion is much more closer to Muslim than it's to Christian. Mm. And still, the Muslims are so uh, anti-Jewish, and a lot of Christians are, are not so anti-Jewish. So, uh, uh, so it's, a, it's a funny kind of uh, mm. relationship. <sighs> well, guys, hmm, now I understand what the man is saying. Like he said, he said, the Judaism is more closer to Islam what is in the Judaism book, the similarities are quite much with the Islam compared to Bible and Quran, he gets it. So he said, there's no big deal in you studying the Quran because when you're studying the Quran, it looks as if you're studying the Judaism book because it's too similar. And that the, the thing is, that he also said that the, the, the thing that even shocked him was the fact that even though the Judaism book is more closer to you know the Islam. Why is that Islam and Judaism? There's no much connection between them, like the way Christianity and Islam come hand in hand to you know talk about their religion. So and he asked the man that, "Have you studied the Quran before?" And the man answered by saying, "No, he has never studied the Quran before." So. To me, at first, I was like, ah, but then why did you ask the question when you didn't add any mind in studying the Quran? 
but it was a good question for anybody that does know having the same mindset of okay i'm a jude um it, uh, my religion is judaism so okay can i study quran can i study bible can i know okay what this book says what this book says and compared to your religion there's no big thing in in, in it and now also short and beautiful even though the rabbi said he does not know anything about quran about islam that he wish he could say much but he does not really know and that's one thing about jewish people they they, they stick to their religion like what is in their book is what they will stick to they don't want to try to research on other books so that they will not you know no they will not deviate or leave something that will make them deviate from their religion you get it so that was a beautiful question that was a beautiful question but uh to me i don't think this question was needed because you can you can be well it's also needed maybe the the person is is kind of scared that if he reads the quran he might you know that might make him convert to islam but if you if you want to learn something you don't have to read the quran per se you can just do some research to understand each book of the of different religions just to have a knowledge about it that doesn't mean that will mislead you or will make you leave your religion but that was a beautiful one thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next one bye